Hey guys, and welcome back. And if you're new here, thanks for joining us today. So we are at a new campground. It is a Thousand Trails Trails collection. Mm -hmm. We haven't been to this one yet. You will be seeing that tour in the very next vlog. But before we give a tour, let's go for a little neighborhood drive so you can get a feel for the area before we check out the campground. But where are we? We are in Oakland Park, I guess. Fort mm -hmm. Lauderdale, Oakland Park area. Right. And the name of the park? The name of the park is Sunshine Holiday. Yeah, <laughs> she got that right. So when you book on Thousand Trails, there's two different Sunshine Holidays. There's a Sunshine Holiday Daytona Beach, and then there's a Sunshine Holiday Fort Lauderdale, which this is more like Lou said, yeah, it's kind of Oakland Park, kind of Fort Lauderdale. It's like on the cusp. Um, yeah, so. these cities sort of blend together because they're so close to each other. Mm -hmm. So we're in the general Fort Lauderdale area and there's a city called Oakland Park. Oakland right. Park. So like we do on every neighborhood drive, we go from the park to Walmart. This one is going to be a super Walmart, whatever it's called, so, yeah. right? Mm -hmm. It's the really big ones. It's like mm -hmm. the department store and the grocery store. Mm -hmm. It even has, I think, a little liquor store, wine and spirits on the I side. Remember. I think so. We're familiar with this area. So yeah. We've been living around this area for a long time. This is sort of near home base yeah yeah it's close by mm -hmm. so let's head to walmart we're gonna focus on everything on the passenger side because it's a short drive and then when we get to walmart and we turn around we'll focus on everything that was on new side which would be passenger side again and today is black friday it is black friday today so the chaos so we are not going in there <laughs> and the traffic is going to be insane uh, all right well let's go for a Hello. drive <laughs> youtube we have just exited the park and here to our right, it's a government building. I believe, I'm pretty sure it's a DCF. And what does DCF stand for? It is Department of Children and Families. Right. And as you'll see directly across the street, there is a Long John Silver. Get your fried fast, fast food fish on. <laughs> That's a tongue twister. Yeah, it is. <laughs> try it uh -uh. no <laughs> i pass oh come on so walmart is actually on the opposite end of where lou's driving but you can't make a left turn right. from the park so you literally have to make a right it's west of here. the park it's the very first traffic light and make a u-turn mm -hmm. this particular street that the park is on is called oakland park boulevard mm -hmm. and it is a highly congested street Yes. This street always has traffic and you want to avoid this street during like business hours, like nine in the morning to 11 and probably from three to six again. If you can, if by you all can. means, Yeah, because this is like jam-packed tra traffic here. And so let's see, next to the Long John Silver, there is a little plaza that has laundry, dentist, chiropractic, a beauty school. Uh, Peter Glenn of Vermont. I've never heard of them. I don't know what they sell. A rental, like, buy-to-own type of furniture, please. And then there's another plaza over here also. There's a Family Dollar in here. Yep, Family Dollar. A beauty beauty supply. supply store, preschool. Mm -hmm. Mickey, um, Mickey D's. Oh. Get your Mickey D's on. French fries or Burger King French fries. McDonald's all the way. Yes, we are both McDonald's french fry fans mm -hmm. there is a chevron here in the corner and this one at the time of this video black friday it's 339 for regular mm -hmm. and 515 for diesel yeah on this particular street in oakland park boulevard you're gonna find a gas station like every other block basically yeah yeah right now we are on martha luther king boulevard mm -hmm. and there's an ihop straight ahead of us yep mm -hmm. so this is like i mentioned before and it's probably going to be a repetitive topic in this particular video it is a highly congested area <laughs> you have everything and anything that you can think of in this area you have all sorts of restaurants this is a multicultural area mm -hmm. and so you have lots of different things going on here from fast food yeah to mom and pop restaurants yep 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 Mom pop restaurants and then chain restaurants such and as chain IHOP. Chain restaurants, right. Of course. Um, all right. So let's see what is going on after this IHOP before we get to Walmart. A little community. 
community. So these are townhomes or apartment homes. And that is a fenced in the aisles at Oakland Park. Yep, with a guardhouse and all. There is a Fort Lauderdale Preparatory School and a church. We have now entered Lauderdale Lakes. There is a Dollar Tree right here and an auto zone. Are you Another sure this is Lauderdale plaza. Lakes already? Yeah, we just passed a sign that said, welcome to Lauderdale Lakes. Okay. Um, a little plaza, which I skipped a bunch of things that were in there, but there's a Popeyes and a hand car wash. Mm -hmm. It's a little park right here. tiny little park it says neighborhood park mm -hmm. a trust hh i'm guessing this is a bank i've never heard of trust hh have you no mm -hmm. can't say that i have but a bank of america here on this corner right now that one's pretty big yeah it is once upon a time we banked with them yep Are you guys loving the sky views on this video? Yeah. The sun Purples is starting to go down. Yeah. So we are on 441 State Road 7, and there is a Domino's here. Estrella Insurance and a Casual Mill XL. Now, there is a huge plaza here to the passenger side, my side, yeah. which we're not going to drive through, but just to call out a few things that you'll find in there. There is a rainbow store, which is actually a discounted clothing store. Really nice clothes. Yeah. There's a Ross. Mm -hmm. There's an Aldi's. Right, right. Do you recall anything else that's in there? Those are the three that I remember. Mm -hmm. Well, there's a Burger King. <laughs> there's a Burger King, yeah. I, I wanna, for some reason, I wanna say there's an arts and crafts store in there. Mm -hmm. Like a Lobby Hobby or maybe like I a, think so, yeah, I think you're right. Or maybe like a Michael's. Mm -hmm. I'm not 100% mm -hmm. sure, but I kind of feel like, like yeah. that's, one of the things that are in there. We're gonna make a U-turn here. We are gonna make a U-turn just because Lou missed that turn. So you don't need to come this far out. But when you're coming from the park, mm -hmm. when you get to State Road 7 or 441, just make sure if you're going to the Walmart, you're in your right lane to mm -hmm. make a right. And if you're gonna to go to one of those stores I just mentioned, the big plaza, Aldi's You're and in stuff. your left lane to make a left to go to the Walmart. Oh yeah, I said right. <laughs> Walmart is left lane, driver's side. <laughs> I always get my lefts and rights confused. You just you had the wrong left. <laughs> so. so Walmart is driver's side, right, uh, left lane, and then Aldi's is passenger side, right lane. Yeah. Mm -hmm. You know, I'm still like in the mindset that I have everything I own in the back of the truck in the oh, bed. So you're driving. Like, and when I go cautious. make a left, I'm like, oh my God, you know, I'll U-turn. I have to be very careful that uh -huh. I don't turn and like everything tips over. Uh -huh. And then I open the bed of the truck and there's like all our belongings belongings have exploded in the back. You right, know? right, right, right. So right now when I was going to make it this U and I was like reminding myself, hey, take it easy when you're making the U. You don't want everything <laughs> to like tip over. <laughs> And then I'm like, wait a second. All right. You already took everything out. It's good. Uh huh. Uh -huh. You're good. I think I can turn in here, right? You can turn in here. Yeah. This is more likely the same one that we'll use to come out. Because from the front, you can only make a right. Okay, so we are turning into the plaza of Walmart now in the corner, right? Right right in the corner of Walmart, which is on Oakland and 441, there is a Walgreens. So if you use Walgreens for your prescriptions, you can always have it transferred here for your refills. Mm -hmm. And I believe I was right. Let me see this little corner entrance of Walmart. Yep, beer, wine, and spirits. Yeah. So you don't necessarily have to look for a liquor store if you're looking for some red wine or a craft beer or your whiskey of choice. Ooh. <laughs> your alcohol of choice. This is jam packed. Yes, There's it like, is. Yes, it is. But this one's always pretty busy mm. anyway, right? It's Wouldn't always chaotic. This, this one, Oakland is, Park Walmart, is always. And I think it's open 24 hours. Yeah, this one. Actually, is. I don't know if they've gone back to that. Do you know if they've gone back? To oh, that? since the big C, mm -hmm. I don't know. I would think so, but pre-pandemic, it mm -hmm. was 24 hours. Right, exactly. And it didn't matter what time you would come here. Mm -hmm. It was always, always busy. Always, always busy. Yeah. Yeah. 
There's your Walmart sign right there <laughs> to confirm that we are here. Oh this my has, God. This one has a garden center as well. I'm sure they don't need confirmation. Well, I mean, if they're just looking at the traffic, <laughs> yeah. they're like, where, where is it? Is it really a Walmart? Are they yeah. joshing us? No, we are not. So we can head out of here. Totally. I'm trying to get to the end so I can get out. <laughs> and work our way east. Yeah, so it's really, really close. I would say probably um, under three miles. Well, under four minutes <laughs> since we started recording, leaving. Okay. Well, at least from our pad to getting here was under four minutes. Right. So that's probably like less than a mile and maybe a mile. So, ooh, I see a Papa John's directly across the street. Mm, not a fan. I, I really like their garlic sauce. Little Caesars has a good garlic sauce too, but Papa John's, for some reason, I prefer theirs. Mm. <laughs> mm. <laughs> I'm not a big pizza fan. You're not. You know, not. I should be because it's bread. Yeah. And bread's my thing, but so. I'm just not a big, I think it's the, the tomato. I'm not a big fan of tomato. So Papa John's Fortune Restaurant, it actually says, oh, Fortune, Fortune Restaurant. Ha, Fortune, Chinese food. that's hilarious. <laughs> You just slug. turned. You turned. I the, swear to God, I, when I saw it, I kind of thought it was Haitian cuisine. Mm. So I'm like fortune, and then I saw Chinese food. I'm like, oh, fortune. You turned it into Italian, <laughs> fortune. Oh, and then this one has top nails. So again, another nail salon, a Crickets, a Value Pawn Shop, and then tax service. And There's shopping. a driver's license place in here too. Is there? Yeah, we oh. came over here. Oh yeah, here. all the way inside. Yeah. Mm -hmm. In this plaza here on the as I make a right to your right inside there's a driver's license bureau okay well that's good to know if anybody needs to do any type of renewals or yeah such. exactly so this Chevron here on the corner as of today's date the regular is 331 and the diesel is 515 that's a deal 331 is a deal yeah you think so yeah it's usually it's been like 339 since we got here oh okay unless you all have the upside app <laughs> Check it out if you don't have it. Uh, Taco Bell. Yum. And Baskin what is Robbins. this? Baskin and Robbins with Dunkin' Donuts and an ice cream shop. That is what Baskin and Robbins is. Well, I mean, I think there's an independent ice cream shop because that ice cream shop sign was different. That's weird. Auto Parts like right next to store. It. Subway. World Famous Something. Oh, Philly Cheesesteaks. Mm -hmm. And then another community, which is across the street from the other one that we saw. This one is apartment buildings. So is it the oh, library there? There's a library there. there. I didn't know there was a library there. Lauderdale the Lakes County. Branch. So if you need your Wi Fi, the yeah. library is not far. Yeah. Absolutely. We have another church here Catholic Health Services there. And these small plazas that we're passing by, if you happen to go in and check it out, they're going to have a lot of different mom and pop restaurants. You're going to run into Chinese restaurants, Jamaican food, yeah. Asian food, Cuban food, yeah. Latin food like Venezuela, Colombia, Brazil. Honduras, Brazil. This is an extremely diverse neighborhood. Mm -hmm. So you're, you're definitely going to find a lot of different things in and around this area. Yeah. Look, the racetrack is right here on the corner. It's three thirty-nine. So yeah. the Chevron was even cheaper. That's the usual. That's the uh, uh, the average price that I've been seeing is between three three thirty-eight, three thirty-nine is what I've been seeing. I would have expected the racetrack to be cheaper than Chevron. Agreed, agreed. Unless they ran out of gas and they're just doing that to bring you mm. in. Sometimes they do that. I see. This. Let's see. What's that? another community over here yeah, on the right hand a side community. these look like townhomes and then another mobile gas station so every single corner you have dueling gas stations yeah, <laughs> across about, from each other absolutely this one's a mobile Say 30, 339 that's about the average so yeah yeah that might be trickery over there 
There's a CVS on this corner. Okay. So, so you you're actually... not short of any pharmacy if, right. you're, if you're getting your prescriptions at Walmart or CVS or, or Walgreens, Walgreens. You're covered in this area. There is a little car dealership here. It's called Carite. Mm -hmm. And that's basically almost And right. next to it, there's another one. Oh, yeah. Mm -hmm. Next car. And yes, yeah. next. I thought they were all one. I didn't even notice that it was two different yeah. signs. They're dueling car dealerships. <laughs> <laughs> so notice now as we approach, you're going to see the big sign for um, advanced auto parts. Right. And then behind that huge sign is the tiny little sign that says Sunshine Holiday. <laughs> and we haven't this seen it lit yet, so we don't know if it lights up or not. Yeah. But you're basically going to turn in here and you're going to go to the back of these buildings. If yeah. you've never been here, you really, really have to look for it because you you will pass it. Yeah, so you're right between the government building and the advanced auto parts. And then there is the gate straight ahead, so you will need a code to get in. Right. And there is a code that you have to punch in at the uh, gate to get in. Or um, if you know somebody here, there's a phone call you can make. So I think right now it's a little too dark for us to turn the camera around and face us and do an outro. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so we will do that as we're driving back to our pad. Um, if you enjoyed this short little drive to the Walmart from Sunshine Holiday and getting to know the area, please give us a big thumbs up. Comment down below if you've been in this area or if you're planning on coming to this area. Mm -hmm. Make sure you hit that subscribe button. And click the notification bell so you can get notified every time we upload a video. And as always, thanks for watching and we'll see you soon. Bye guys!